guys, I'm back. Today I'm going to read Philemon 1, Hebrews 1 to 6, Proverbs 27, and Psalm 95. Let's get started. Paul, a prisoner of Christ Jesus, who Christ Jesus and Timothy are brought to Philemon, our beloved fellow, and Aphia, our sister, and Archip is our fellow soldier in the church in your house. Here's to him, peace from God, our Father, and Lord Jesus Christ. I say my God always when I remember you in my prayers, because I hear you love and the faith that you have I have toward the Lord Jesus and for all the saints. And I pray that the sharing of your faith may become effective for the full knowledge of every good thing. And it's in us for the sake of Christ. So I derive much joy and comfort from your love, my brother, because in the hearts of the saints have been refreshed through you. If only that I'm bold enough in Christ to command you to do what is required. And for love's sake, I prefer to appeal to you. To appeal to you. I, for an old man, now prisoner, is so Christ you. I appeal to you for my child once and as his father, I became my prisoner. Well, Normally he would use the useless prisoner to you, but now he is indeed useful to you and me. I am sending him back to you, sending my very heart. I would have been glad to keep him with me, in order that he might send him out on your behalf during my imprisonment for the gospel. I prefer not to do anything without your consent, or that your goodness might not be my compulsion, but of your own accord. For this is perhaps is why he was part of me for a while, that you might have him back forever, no longer as a bond servant, and more than a bond servant, as a beloved brother. A beloved brother, especially to me. Uh, how much how much more to you, both in the flesh and in the Lord. So you can see that your partner receives him as you receive him. He is really, if he's wrong to you at all or owes you anything, charge that to my account. I pull right this with my own hand, I will pay. Say nothing of your own, even your own self. Yes, but I want some benefit from you in the Lord. Refresh my heart in Christ. You know, I'm your obedience and right to know that you will do even more, even more than I say. At the same time, prepare a guest room for me, for I'm having it through your Christ. I'll be graciously given to you. I paraphrase my fellow prisoner in Christ Jesus and his greetings to him that are serving well. I just chase demons and make my fellow work for the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. You hear the Spirit. From Hebrews 1 to 6. Long ago, and many times in many ways, God spoke to our fathers and the prophets, so that in these last days he has spoken to us by his son. And he appointed the head of all things through whom he is, and he created the world. His reign is the glory of God and exactly imprinted with nature. He upholds the universe by the word of the child. After making a vocation for sins, he sat down to my hand, and the master of my home becomes much superior to angels, and as the name he inherited is more excellent than that. Uh, to which the angels did God ever say, You are my son, today I will be God for you. Well, again, I'll be to my father, and shall be to my son. And again, when he brings the first one to one, he says, Now will God's angels worship me. Well, then, off the angels, he says, He makes his angels wins, and ministers of the plan of fire. But after the sun, he says, You're throwing a God for forever and ever. Accept your uprightness and accept your wickedness. You have uprightness and hate wickedness, therefore, God. God and your God is not she, and the glory of God is beyond your companions. You and you, Lord, lay the foundation of the earth in the beginning. And until the work you have, they will perish with you and me. And all where, all where, like a garment, like a rope, you will build them up. Like a garment, they will be changed, but you are the same, and your use will have no end. And to which of the angels has, has he ever said, Sit my right hand until I make it and make your footstool for your feet? Are they not all unmistering? I don't think not all ministering spirits. So now it's the earth for the sake of those who are doing that salvation. Therefore, we must pay much closer attention to what we have. As we drift away from this, and since the message is to cry by angel, prove to be reliable and every transgression or disobedience. For this is a just retribution. How shall we escape if we neglect such a great salvation? We will declare it first by the Lord, and it was attested to us by those who heard. Our God is a bull, and his mass and the wonders and various miracles, and we give the Holy Spirit to stray the tail point as well. So it is not to angels that God subjected the world to come, and of which we are speaking, for it has been testified something. Well, it was meant that you are my father, and not the son of man that you care for. You may him for a little while lower than the angels, you are crying what is going on. Putting everything in subjection under his feet, and putting everything in subjection to him. You left nothing outside his control. Now, at present, we do not yet see everything in subjection to him. I see him who for a who for a little while has made known. Then the angels name of Jesus come with glory, and in all now because of the suffering and death, so that by the grace of God he might taste death forever. For it is fitting that he, of whom and by whom all things exist, and bring many sons to grace, and make the founder of their salvation perfect through suffering, for he is sanctified in those who sanctify, all of one source. That's why he is not ashamed of both of us. I'll tell you in your diet, because in the midst of the congregation I'll sing your praise. And again, I'll put my trust in him. And again, behold, I am the children God has given me. It is therefore the children share flesh and by himself. He himself life must partake of the same thing, and through death he might destroy the one who is the power of death, and is the devil, and deliver all those who brought fear and thought of it, who created it, who subject to my false state, for surely it is not injured that he helps, and he was the offspring of Abraham, and therefore he had to be made like his parents, in every respect, so that he might become a and faithful high priest, and so as he got to make propitiation for the sins of people. And because he himself has suffered, and tempted, he is able to help those who are being tempted, tempted. therefore, holy brothers, you share in our heavenly call. 
Oh, I can say to you is there. I'll pass on high priest without confession. I'll be faithful to him with a point him. Just as when the sister was faithful and good time. Jesus has been encountered by the more glory than most. And that's why it's glorious the builder of the house is more honored than the house itself. Uh, now, my husband is faithful in all God's house to serve. So, that's why I did think I would do spirit the man. We Christ is faithful with God's house. And the son, we are his house indeed. If, we, if indeed we call fast, no confidence, no boasting in our hope. Therefore, as the Holy Spirit says, today we hear his voice, now harden your hearts as in the word of God. On the day of testing the Lord, so your father put me to the test until my wish for four years. Your father's provided with that generation, they say. And you must go away in that, straight in the heart. But you do not know my ways, as I saw in my wrath, they shall not enter my rest. And then I care about this, there be in any of you evil. I'm bleeding hard, and bleeding you to fall away from the living God. It's called one another every day, as long as it's called today. So that none of you may be harmed by the deceitfulness of sin. For we, when we have come to shame, Christ, if indeed we hold our original confidence firm to you, as it is said today, if you hear his voice, do not harm your hearts as in the obey. Now who are those who heard in your river? Your river. There is not all those left in Egypt, left Egypt, who left Egypt, left by this. And with him was he put right for you. Was not with those who his bodies found at once. And to him do we swear that they would not endure in his rest. But to those who are disobedient, they seem that they were unable to enter because unbelief. Therefore, why the promise of entering his rest also? Uh, as we had less than you, we have even seemed to have to reach you. For you and his king does just as to them, but the message they had do not have fit them. There is no known united by faith with those in listen. When we who believe into that rest, as he has said, I swear in my wrath they shall not enter my rest. When those works are finished and the foundation of the world, he is somewhere speaking the seventh day in this way. And he wrote first on the seventh day from all his works, and he gave this passage, he said, He shall not enter my rest. Because therefore it remains to some danger, and those who form the issue of the good news have to enter because of disobedience, and again he appoints a certain day. And today he sings you, David, so long after, and the words already quoted. Today, if he hears what's still on your hearts, and if Joshua had given them rest, God would have spoken, and husband has spoken of another day later on. But then there are many sons of us for the people of God. Whoever has entered God's rest has their service of God's works as God did from his. Let us therefore strive to enter the world of rest, so we don't be fooled by the same sort of disobedience. The word of God's living and active, sharper than any true issue. Listen to the division of soul and spirit, and joins in the and send out the design of God's intentions of the heart. And no creature is hidden from us, but all are naked and exposed to the eyes of him of whom to whom we must give account. Since then we have a great high priest who has passed through the hands. Jesus is only above this whole fast and confession. We don't have a high priest who is only able to sympathize with our weaknesses, the one who in every respect has been tempted as we are. Yet without, yet without sin, we know that with confidence, draw near to the throne of grace, and that we may receive mercy and find grace to help in time of need. Time. You know, every high priest chosen from among men is appointed to act on behalf of men. In relation to God, to offer gifts and sacrifice for sins, he can deal gently with the ignorant way, but since he was always beset with weakness, and because of this, he is obligated to offer sacrifice for his own sins, just as he does to those people. And no one takes the honor for himself, but only will go with them. Just as Aaron was, so as Christ did not exalt himself to be made a high priest, as appointed by him, he said to him, You are my son today, have begun me. So then he says, O son, I will the high priest, however, after the order of Melchizedek, and in the days of as Jesus offered a present supplication for the high priest, and Tim was able to save, save him from death. He was heard because of his reverence, though he was son, he learned obedience through, word, through what he suffered, and being made perfect. He became the source of the eternal salvation to all of it, and this man might go on a high priest after the order of Melchizedek. Now that this became much today, it's hard to explain. This year become dull of hearing, but though by this time you ought to be teachers, you need someone to teach you again the basic principles of the old Zua. You need milk, not salt, fear for everyone who lives on milk is unskilled in the word of righteousness. And see that the child is all food is enough for the mature. But those who have their powers of discernment, trained by constant practice, to distinguish good from evil. And for those, leave the elementary doctrine of Christ and go on to maturity, not laying again a foundation of repentance from dead works and the faith to one God. The instruction about washing and laying on the hands, the resurrection of the dead, and the time of judgment. I don't know if, and this will he will do if God permits. No, it is impossible in the case of those who once been alive. And if we who have tasted heaven again, yeah, and share in the Holy Spirit and taste the goodness of the word of God. And share in the Holy Spirit and taste the goodness of the word of God. And in the powers of other age to find their fall away. To restore them again to repentance and stay crucified again. And the Son of God to their own home and holding up to contempt. And then they drunk the rain that often falls on it. And produce a cup useful to those whose sake is called to me. This is a blessing from God, but if it is for thorns, it is worthless in the age of being cursed. And it's intended to be bad, though we speak in this way. Yeah, in your case, the world, we feel sure better things. Yeah, things that belong to salvation. Uh, God is not unjust, so as to overlook it all. And love the dear shit of who it may as me. There's nothing that says this, you still do. And I desire each one of you to share the same earnestness to have the full share. I have been told the answer that you may not be slighted. 
Imitations of those who through faith and patience inherit the promises. When God made a promise to Abraham, since he had no longer by him, just where he swore by himself, saying, so Surely all the same will be And was thus Abraham very from patiently and by obtained the promises. He was swear by something greater than the sun. In order that this feeds an oath is wrong for confirmation. So when God decided to show more convincingly to the heads of the promise, the unchangeable character of his promise he grant to you with an oath, so that by two unchangeable things, the way in which is impossible, but to lie. We, being, we who have fled for refuge, I have a strong encouragement to hold fast and hope so for us. We have this as a strong step as anchor the soul, and the hope that enters into the inner place behind the river, which you said, born as a fall on our path, our path, and become a high priest forever after the order of Melchizedek. For this much is that king's in, priest and most high May Abraham return from the soul of his kings in blessing, and to him Abraham proportion to him part of everything. It says, by translation, he was named King of Rights, so he is. He is just a king saying, there is king of peace. He is our father and our mother and genealogy, having neither the beginning of days, nor end of life, nor is the king, nor son of God, he continues to preach forever. See how great this man who was to him, Abraham, the patriarch, gave a tenth to the sports, and those descendants of Abraham received the priestly office of the kingdom, and Lord to take tithes from the people of Venice, and the Venice. There are these are some descendants from Abraham. This man who does not have the peace and the end of received tithes from Abraham, and blessed him who had the pumps in. And it is beyond dispute that the inferior was by the superior. Yet in the one case, I shall see by more men, and the other case by one. Not one of whom is to tie the evil. One might even say, No, leave by himself. Who sees ties, pay ties to Abraham. He has done the Lord's his ancestors and all just dead men. And I have perfected the being a chain with the Levitical priesthood. And without further need would there be for another priest, I took right after the order of Master Jimmy, rather one named after the order of Abraham. But when there is a chain in the priesthood, there is necessarily a change in the order as well. The one of whom these things spoke in the long term of Jew, from which no one has ever served at the altar. The government of the Lord is descended from Jew, in connection with the trial of Moses and nothing but about priests. This becomes even more evident when another priest arises in the likeness of Moses and those who come priests not on the basis of a legal requirement, because they not only be descent, but by the power of the indestructible life for his witness at hand. You are a priest who have after the altar of Moses, but on that one hand, a form commitment sets up. This is its weakness and uselessness. Mm. Proverbs, Proverbs 27. Do not boast about tomorrow, for you don't know what a day may bring. When another person in your own mouth is strange in my ear, the stones have been sent for you, but false provocations have been but that's going all anger is overwhelming. He is damned for jealousy, but it is open and beaten him off. Pay for the winds of friend, produces the kisses of the man, and one who is full of those hands, but one who is hungry of the good history. And I can bear the chase from his nest and the man's chase from his son. One of them both of me I am the sweetness of rain comes to the castle. Don't forsake your friend and your father's friend. Do not go to your father's house and day of calamity. As neighbor is near, my brother is far away. He was my son, make my heart glad that I may answer him every question. Prince is danger high, so the simple go and suffer. The command called away of security for strain. Hold him back when he puts up security for not doctors. I bless his neighbor from that boy, he's rising out of the night. While we count his cousin, you can tell him you're dripping about rain day. And I am. And I am close to my father. The strain is still strained away. I want to cross the oil on my hand. I shall have a man, one man shall put another, whoever well, tends to victory where he eats with. He causes the master will be on his mortal face with black face. So the hard man afflicts the man, so on the bad man is suffer. Then it says for the wise man, the quick was within the hands of the world. Then it's just my price, quick born and mortal with the pencil, one of the fish green, yet his body will not depart from me. No other condition, if we can give attention to her, to her, to her, to her, to her, and those who can enjoy the old generation, the girl's gone in the old new birth, in the new birth place, and the vegetation of animals, because the man shall provide you for them, because the price of food. The next great move for your food, for the food you have some maintenance for your girls. Psalm 95. Here I come, let's sing to the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the rock of my house of wish. Let's go into his presence with thanksgiving. Let us make a beautiful noise to him with songs of praise. The Lord is a great God and a great King above all gods. And his hand out the depths of the earth. In the highest of the mountains, I say so. So you see how he made it. And his hand full of joy. Here I come, boy. Let us worship him better. Yes, yeah, new before the Lord, I'll make him who he is, and I'll be all the people's master. The sheep is sent to David, his voice, to hide their hearts as I remember. No long day, must in the wilderness. When you are put to the test and put me to the proof, and I did see my work for forty years, I live in Jewish. So there are people who go straight in the heart, and they do not know my wife, they push all my rest. They do not enter my rest. Now this is the lesson I did last part. May God have fallen down, how they be in the kingdom come here with other thesis in heaven. Let us stand there, and give us a death series of our debtors. It's not temptation, I have seen you one. This king is a kind of the river of the Amen. See you tomorrow. Bye.